Hi, this is Joe Herman. I've seen a lot of workstations and mobile workstations over the years, but when I first laid my eyes on the HP ZBook Studio X360 convertible mobile workstation, I knew that this was going to be something special. Of course, workstations are just another name for very powerful computers with top-rated components that are made especially for industrial strength applications such as creative media creation and things like that. The ZBooks are HP's line of mobile workstations, as opposed to their big iron workstations such as the ultra-powerful Z8 workstation. That's some serious horsepower there. But for those looking for a mobile solution, we're talking about the ZBooks. Within the ZBook line, there are the ZBook Studios. And among the ZBook Studios, there are two in particular. There's the ZBook Studio and the ZBook Studio X360. And in my opinion, the ZBook Studio X360 convertible workstation might be one of the best machines for creative professionals ever made. Now let's take a closer look at this machine and see what makes it so special. You would expect a premium looking machine like this to come in a great looking box, and it does. The inside cover is lined with black foam. Let's turn on the machine, the power button's on the side. There's a cool facial recognition system which will unlock the system when it recognizes your face. This screen is a touch screen which is useful for swiping through and zooming into your apps. The HP ZBook X360 is a convertible PC. That means that it can take a traditional laptop form, perfect for doing things like running 3D apps or video editing. Or you could put it in tent mode, which is good for presenting your work. Or you might want to do this, which could be useful for using the touch screen or using it as a display or a monitor. But perhaps the most useful mode is to rotate the screen all the way back, converting the machine into a flat, tablet-like form. But it's not simply tablet-like operation that makes this computer so great. You see, the HP ZBook X360 convertible mobile workstation comes with this highly sensitive AES Wacom pen, which is great for digital painting, 3D sculpting, photo retouching, concept artwork, and many other creative applications. This makes the ZBook X360 an awesome artist's machine. The ZBook X360 has a 4K 15.6 inch IPS EDP LED backlit Corning Gorilla Glass display, but its ability to paint on it makes it so valuable to digital artists, photo retouchers, and digital sculptors, or for that matter, any application that takes input from a pen. I wanted to try out the digital painting capabilities of the HP ZBook X360 myself, so I decided to use it to paint a picture in Photoshop. I started by opening up Photoshop, then making a new file, which I set to be 1920 pixels by 1080 pixels high. There's a handy pop-up keyboard that comes up, which makes it easy to enter alpha numeric input. As you can see, the HD size frame, 1920 by 1080, only takes up about a quarter of the screen because this is a 4K display. It's extremely high resolution display. I started painting some clouds using the uh, mixer brush, which gives you a sort of a wet into wet effect when you're painting. So you can get some blendy type of brushwork going on there. Next I started putting in some background mountains with a green color. As you can see I'm using my left hand as well as my fingers to navigate through the canvas and move it around and zoom in and out of it. Then I put in some foreground land so to create kind of a river or lake in the middle. And I started painting a tree. 
The brush's opacity was pressure sensitive, but not the size, so I quickly made it so that the size and the transparency would be pressure sensitive. I started painting the branches as well as the leaves on the tree, just by building up some color. Next, I started painting in a little bit of shade and texture on the tree trunk and continued building up the leaves on the top of the tree. So you can see there's that left hand, which is handy for pinching in and zooming in and moving it around. Then I started adding some highlights onto the uh, water to give it some nice texture and started painting in some grass in the foreground. I decided I wanted another tree on the side, so I started painting that in as well. And then changing the size of my brush to be a little bit smaller for a little bit more detail. Here's a different camera angle where I continued working on that tree on the side. This time I'm adding some leaves. Uh, onto the tree, building up some leafy textures on that tree as well. And adding a little bit of shade on the tree, like I did on the other one. Get a sense of the light a little bit, adding a little sort of dead branch there, and continuing on to get the bark texture on the tree. Moving back to work on the leaf texture. I decided I wanted a little figure climbing on or standing by the shore. So I started painting her dress, a white dress, changing the size of my brush. Sort of a welcoming, friendly person in the scene. Adding some more grass here and going back to fill in the figure in the middle of the picture. Next I'm adding some flowers, some red flowers in the foreground as well as some yellow flowers in the foreground. This is a spring day so there's a lot of flowers around. Adding a little bit more texture onto the water. A little bit more light dancing upon its surface. Filling out the water on the right. Adding some vegetation on the opposite shore of the river. And a little bit more on the water itself. using the numeric input of the keyboard. Filling in some of the trunk and branches of the tree. Adding some white flowers this time near our figure. Changing the size of the brush again in order to add my signature. Pretty much finished with my picture, Spring Day by the River. The HP ZBook X360 is also available with an HP Dream Color 4K UHD display. The premium silver tone chassis is made out of precision crafted machined aluminum. On the right side of the workstation you'll find an SD memory card reader which is useful for ingesting images and videos from your camera. 
Next, there's an audio out, audio in jack. To the right of that is a vent for airflow to cool internal components. An HDMI port allows you to connect to HDTVs, displays, or other video systems. There are two USB Type-C connections which also serve as super fast Thunderbolt 3 ports. With it, you can also connect to the new HP Thunderbolt 3 dock. Speaking of that, the new HP Thunderbolt dock is a very useful and compact docking solution that provides additional ports such as USB 3 ports, display ports for connecting external displays, more Thunderbolt 3 ports, a legacy VGA port, and an Ethernet port that allows you to connect to wired networks. The Thunderbolt 3 port also has features for advanced network manageability. In addition, you can also get the optional HP Thunderbolt dock audio module which fits on the top of the dock. It attaches vertically to the HP Thunderbolt dock with no additional cabling and includes advanced built-in audio conferencing features. On the right side is a USB super speed charging port, another USB 3.0 port, a tiny SIM card slot, a security cable slot, cooling vent, power button, which due to the fact that the machine is convertible, is on the side. An interesting addition to the ZBook X360 is that it comes with these keys, present, answer, and hang up. These keys are useful for group collaboration and conferencing. Speaking of collaboration, the HP ZBook X360 is the world's first mobile workstation with a noise-canceling world-facing microphone. That could really be helpful in meetings. For its CPU, this machine has a powerful 6-core Intel Xeon E2186M processor. It is also available with i7 and i9 processors. Its video card is an NVIDIA Quadro P1000 with 4GB of dedicated GDDR5 video memory. But you can also get it with an NVIDIA P2000 card, which has more CUDA cores. Here are the results of the Cinebench test, which measures the speed of the CPU, and the Octane Bench test, which measures the performance of the GPU. For memory, this machine has 32 gigabytes of DDR4-2666 memory, but it can also be configured with a whopping 64 gigabytes. This machine has a 1 terabyte NVMe M.2 SSD for storage. However, it will support up to 6 terabytes of overall storage. This HP ZBook X360 convertible has a 6 cell 96 watt hour long life battery, which can deliver an impressive 16 hours of battery life, depending on what you're doing, of course. Thanks for watching this video about HP's ZBook Studio X360 mobile workstation. Please like and subscribe, and see you next time.